Ovulation and menstruation both are regular cycles in women's life. These cycles are counted from 1 day to 28 days. Sometimes, this cycle can be different from woman to woman. Most of the women confuse to calculate this cycle, and they don't identify the difference between these cycles. Today in this video, I will discuss the top 5 differences between ovulation and menstruation cycles. If you are new to this channel you can subscribe to this channel, because it can be a great collection for you. Ovulation happens when eggs are released from your ovaries to be fertilized. This process starts during the middle stage of the women's cycle. The ovulation cycle is 28 days, but it can also be 27, 29, or 30 days. Menstruation means period cycle. The length of this cycle is 28 days, but it can also be 27, 29, or 30 days. Women discharge bleeding over a period of time, and this bleeding stays normally for 5 to 7 days. Normally ovulation dates start in the 15 days of the women's cycle. It lasts at least 5 days, but sometimes it can stay for 7 days. Menstruation starts on the first day of women's cycle. It stays normally 7 days, but sometimes it can stay for 5, 6, or 8 days. If women feel an irregular period, their ovulation and menstruation dates can be unusual and irregular in every month. Ovulation is connected to pregnancy. When women get ovulation they discharge eggs to meet with a sperm. The period is not connected to the pregnancy. Women's bodies discharge blood during this period of time. If a woman has contact with her partner during ovulation, she can be pregnant but if a woman contacts her partner during the period, she cannot be pregnant. Women experience a few common symptoms in their ovulation and menstruation time. The most common symptoms of ovulation are increased body temperature, changes in cervical mucus, breast pain, lower abdomen pain, and light spotting. The most common symptoms of menstruation are abdominal pain, breast pain, feeling fatigue, headache, mood swings, and bleeding from the private part. Menstruation is not connected to ovulation. You can ovulate if you don't get your menstruation. You can also get your menstruation if you don't get your ovulation. On the other hand, you can get your ovulation without the symptom, but bleeding is the mandatory symptom for menstruation. <laughs> 